We're kind of just trying to isolate the big blind who's short and he's got a decent bounty. And if he donk shows, we snap, which he should be doing like 80% of the time. Because why else do you stop and go? If you're not going to stop and go 10 8, 5 Run the numbers, come on. I'm just like, I'm waiting. Alright, beat King 9. Hold. Nice. Beat him to the pot. And we get a $25 bounty. We're off to a good start here in the 55. It's 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 a straight lineup, guys. It's a straight lineup. There's a direct correlation between when I moved on in poker. Now let Ryan. There's a direct correlation between where I went uptick and when I when I sought out uh, some of the best and the best for coaching. Uh, I think we definitely need a double barrelless. Uh, we have more aces in his range. Uh, I don't even think we. I mean, are we ever gonna get a king to fold? No. So I don't think we need a size bigger. I think we should size standardish. I just don't think you can call too many triple barrels here unless he has two pair. And he just snaps me with ace nine. Okay. Yep. That's gonna call. Um, we're not we're not trying to get ace nine to fold there. We're also all in here. I'll come back to the nines if we get called. Uh, that's not the greatest, but it's actually not the worst. We do get called. Nines versus sevens here. Hold the baby. Hold the baby. No, no eight. Nice. Okay, we win that, and we win that. Let's go. We win. Boom, boom. Triple up here. Double up here. Oh, fuck you, Nicholson. Come on. He's definitely just got, like, sevens here. Ugh. You gotta be kidding me. God, I don't really don't want to hard bubble this. There's no way we're gonna make it to the money bubble. Hold! No queens. Please, God. Mm, you gotta be fucking kidding me. Damn. Can't fold for bat. Wow, he's got king queen. Okay, that's just awful. Well, this is interesting. Okay, so it's a limp pot. I don't really want to fold here. I think we just send it. Hold. Hey! Double me up! Just gonna be a no. Marcelo is a reg that I chat with sometimes. Ugh. That zero fold equity, baby. Alright, we're gonna see if we can talk him into folding. <laughs> oh. Now we got some fold equity. That's some fold equity. That's that good shit. Hold the baby. Hold. Yes. Yes. Hold. No clubs. Pair the board. Starfish, $22 bounty. Nope. Disagree. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think I'm supposed to be something fun. Funny range. Ooh, we just donk leads. Saucy, someone's got two hearts. Mm, not the turn we need. We're gonna punch shove here with King Queen. Gonna flip for the, the couple big lines we have here. Whoa. Whoa, king. Seven. Alright, we're gonna check back this turn here. River's a five. I think we're gonna turn our four into a bluff, because he's gonna have five X, he's gonna have some nine X. I don't think he heroes with yeah, I like turning my hand into a bluff here. Dang. He shoves, we're gonna get it in. Good look us. King Jack versus Ace Nine. We can get there. Not yet, but on a river. Fuck. Dump them up. Maybe we'll be the bubble boy, you know? Maybe we just run into kings here. Maybe we run into ace king and we just lose the flip. That happens. This guy does open a decent amount though, so it's not like he's never opening worse. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Uh, we won nines versus queens and ace ten. All right, well, the no snap is usually a good sign, but we could be getting slow rolled. I don't know. Oh my god! Oh! <laughs> Fold. 
Fold selection. Okay. Win the flip now. Give me an eight. Give me an eight. Fuck. Man, I can't believe he had aces that one time. That was nasty. Normally when he checks back, he's gonna have a ten. Fuck it. I set the price. I set the price that I'm gonna call. I set the price. I think it's too much Queen Jack here. I think it's a good river to bluff because we have Queen Jacks and he doesn't have too much Queen Jack in his range, in my opinion. I think a lot of that checks back. Did he really check back Queen Jack here? Wow. You checked back Queen Jack on the flop? Unless he's just shoving like jacks. Uh, I think we're gonna reshuffle for the bounty here. Kill Gus. Fold bad bowmen. Fold. You can fold, it's okay. Fold. Make the good fold. Fold like sevens here, please. Fold sevens, now. Fuck, ran at eights. Running spades. Just a four. Well, there was the river spade. I told him, I told him, there's plenty of time to punt before the final table. We're not gonna be guaranteed this final table here. But you need to be playing every poker tournament to make the most amount of money possible. And sometimes making the most amount of money possible is by just trying to find min cash or just folding for the money, you know? Not the best flop. We're stacking off here versus this guy. We're just gonna shove on the pot. We're just gonna pot shove. Oh, can we not get check raised here? Well, that's an attorney's gonna bluff, so that's a really good turn for me. Because we, if we have Queen X, we're not folding. If he shoves, we're in trouble. Yeah, but... Jack 5. Wow. That's not good. Oh. No clubs. Yes. Bang! Bang! With the dub ski. Alright, here we go. This could be the bust out here. Yeah, it is. Alright, GG, my friend. You give the bounty to... Uh, a nice person, so I'm cool with that. And this raid, the shove got through with Ace King. Oh, okay, here we go. Ace 10 versus 6 9. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. All right, we have a shove and an ISO shove here. We're going to move this so we can see his hand. Wow, he calls with Ace Queen. An Ace or a Queen, and we have a double KO here. Wow, Barry Greenstein. Just like that, we're down to five. Uh, MSK Savart is just headhunting. Okay. Ace three versus ace eight. Drills the three. Drills the eight. All right, GG selection. Right, we're three bet. So we don't have a big bounty. We have by far the worst bounty in this tournament now. Um, so you can't expect people to blast a little bit wider than normal because I think the chips are worth way more than my bat. What my bounty is worth right now. Hold. Pair the board. Yes. He might just be a recreational. He's playing 52, 44, 30. Let me see about a little bit larger. So it was a coin. Alright, it does hit me with the check raise, which are kind of what I was expecting here from him. Now we're gonna call. That is a bad turn card for me. Probably gonna have to shut down and probably just give up when it grows. That's a dank meme. That's a continuation of a joke from yesterday. I think he's got the gear just to shove River. But I also think he does have two pairs here. This kind of just sucks, but he does check raise bluff, just random shit. But I think sometimes he's just gonna have it here. It sucks, but we're gonna fold. Fold it. That was one of the greatest things I heard at Run Out of Reno. He's like, this fucking idiot called 10,000 chips. It was like two bigs. <laughs> wow, that's a flop. Great, that's gonna be clipped. Eh, let's keep all of his pure buffs in. I kinda wanna lead turns though. Yeah, I just think he checks back turns way too frequently. Yeah, just, oh, fuck it, we'll check. 
Flipping for a tournament life here. All right, we're dead in the hot 27. We get 50 first, GG. Cash for uh, 61 bucks in that. All right, we're definitely gonna have to check raise here. Can we just cool a room here, please? Yeah, there's no way we lose this pot unless the board pairs. I just realized that was the stupidest thing to say. There's no way we have a worse hand because we have the nuts. That's, that's science. All right, the board doesn't pair. Bang. Bang, chip lead. It's a pretty good flop for our particular hand. All right, we get check raised here. He could be check raising with better draws sometimes. Actually, I think he's king high or queen high flush draws are probably just a check call. So I think the vast majority of the time we actually are gonna be fine. Pick up an eight, that works. Uh, queen of diamonds, please. Then I know we're gonna win. Ten. I don't think we can call here. I think this is too wide. I think it's too ambitious of a call. I don't think he's gonna do this with two pair. But it's like, how much 9x do we really have, right? Not a lot. So... I'm gonna sweat this real quick for the stream. Bad flop for my friend here. Horrible turn. Get it all. I think I think we just can't be calling this Jack Eight here. I mean, we like Jack Nine, but it's like how often is he gonna show up with Jack Nine here? I just don't. I don't think he's capable of it enough to hero off the Eight there. All right. Fuck. All right, we're not gonna get that bounty. Feels bad, man. Tens versus ace queen. We're probably gonna get the latter. Nice. They do. All right, down to three. Yo, what's up, Doyle Bronson? What's up? I never MTG. I never. I never EMTG. That's a fucking dream flop when we fly with aces. Nice little deuce of spades would really. All right, we lose to kings now. This might slow him down a lot, I think, if he doesn't have kings. Hmm. Do we just cooler him? Does he just have ace ace king? Wow. This fucking run out. Cause like I just don't think he's calling. Part of me just wants to check this back. Uh, I was thinking about chopping the prize pool, but uh, now I'm just going to play for it. God, we even have the ten of diamonds, so we don't we just like super block everything you can have that would call a raise. I'd rather raise here than just flat. Let me see. You could always just bluff shove river. Wow, that's a good river. Because he's going to be able to hero call this river if he ever had a hero call. I didn't have a hero calling in. From Southern to Chip Leader, the greatest in the world. Thanks for the 500 bits, Born in 1500. Damn, you've, you've got me for like almost 2,000 bits so far. My man. Right. I mean, we should still be C betting here. I don't think he's going to check shove all this queens, but when he does raise call, it does have a fair amount of queens in his range. That's a great turn for me because now it reduces how much Queen X combos he has. He has some spade combos. I like checking and then we're just kind of calling a lot of rivers. I don't know if he shoves river, it's going to suck, but I do like checking and then playing some rivers. Check calling and. I'm going to bet really tiny here. King 10. Okay. You bink 510 UFC? Um, not since the last time I played it. We did win like four buy-ins or five buy-ins last time we played it, though. We really don't like hitting flops versus him. How does he get like the driest flops every time? Oh, we're gonna needle because I thought he was gonna see that. I like checking if he's gonna check because he probably has a five or a deuce. Definitely doesn't have three four. 
three, four, probably C bets. You have a four high. Right, I think we definitely value better six on the river. I think he's telling a story that he's got like a five, like ace five. There we go. Easy peasy. Yeah, ace eight. Wow. Ains are vesting. I'm just gonna tease you with it and just tell you I did, but not actually show you. Ace ten versus threes. Fuck. Oh, that sucks. No. No. Fuck. All right, we're playing heads up versus MSK. Heads up versus MSK. Oh fuck, we snap checked. Whoops. Ooh, a half pot. That's a saucy bet. I don't like this. Just some 9x, but there's so many draws that brick. Wow, he plays with both the fucking club ends. Hurt. Oh, we're all in in the bounty builder. Shoving that ten suited here. Utilizing fold equity to our max. We can get shoved done by these two, but they can't shove on me without anything. Yeah. All right. Well, at least we're going for a bounty. Oh my god, this is perfect. We need a jack dealer. Jack. Fuck. Mm. Yeah, we'll give him some rope. Maybe we win this end. Nope. Oh, Alright, go last. We're gonna 3-bet shove here with Ace-8 suited. Fuck. Eight! Ah, we're gonna double him up. Fuck. Uh, we were chip leader for a long time, and then break ended. We started, or break started. Uh, we play, started to play through the break, and then we lost two big hands. We lost, uh, we shut, we ended up shoving ace eight into ace king, and then we got, uh, another pot that we just lost. And then he just took an overwhelming chip lead, and we've been at this stacked up this whole time. Barry? Barry! Yeah, honestly, we played really, really good heads up. Oh, for fuck's sake, we got seconding it. We played really, really good. Um, it's just, we just weren't able to get anything going to end that tournament we just were caught on the negative side of variance for the second night in a row we get second with no bounties oh gg msk besides that one ace forehand i think he played pretty well heads up so we're not gonna be that upset about it usually when it comes to shit like that our edge is gonna be thin but it's gonna be there it's just sometimes you're just gonna lose it played well Hats off to him. So we lose the heads up. We get four hundred ninety-six dollars plus our twenty-five dollar bounty for like five hundred and twenty something. It's really annoying. Really, really, really annoying to get second in this again with no bounties. We got one bounty, or we got two bounty. Yeah, we we KO'd one person at the start of it for $25 and then that was literally it for the rest of the tournament.